Yep. He's okay. He's o yeah. He's okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, he, 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 uh, I don't really, you know, I haven't talked to anybody yet, but he was in the locker room, he's fine. Just, you know, uh, you guys will get used to me, I err on the side of caution with my team, you know, so, um, but yeah, you think he took a header into the, into the bleachers, somebody should have caught him. Wait till I see the film, somebody's in trouble. Yeah, yeah. I used to do that all the time. Coach, what can you say about the, the defensive effort? It seemed to, you know, be picked up a little bit. I think you had four or five, uh, uh, drew four or five charges. Uh, yeah, you know, um, winning early in the season and winning in conference played two different things. You guys getting used to me being there in my third year. You know, conference games are bloodbaths. Um, coaches are uh, fighting for their life. By now, kids are sick of losing uh, the, of, the, of the teams that don't have a great record, and the fight is on. Um, so I thought we fought a lot harder as the game went on defensively. They made some shots, though, in the first half. You know, points in the paint were plus 18. Points off turnovers were plus nine. So there's our hustle stats. You know, we didn't offensive rebound the ball, but we didn't. We only missed 18, shot, 18 shots on the game. So the thing I told the team, guys, is uh, this was perfect um, statistically because, you know, we, we got up 20 and one handily and only made two threes. You know, since I've been here, every time we try to jump shoot our way to victory, we, we get into a bad we – we're not a good team anymore. When we try to play hard uh, – Scrap, claw, fight, and we're still getting there because they got 11 offensive rebounds. So that's that's something we got to clean up. Now that being said, we had five guards on the floor at times. So, uh, uh, Jalen uh, filled in for Jaime. What can you say about his performance? Played great. He's got. I told him he got to get in better shape. You know, he hasn't played that many game minutes. Um, you know, but uh, he probably thought he played great. You know, he and Peyton Watson continue to get better. Peyton. Peyton, you know, I don't look, his stats mean nothing to me. Like, I, you know, I look at Peyton's floor game defensively, block shots, rebound activity, defense, his, his attitude. Uh, you know, he, he and, he and uh, Jalen continue to improve. It's huge for us. I got to get Cody back on the glass. He's only got 11 rebounds in four games since he returned. Um, two quick things. Uh, Jaime's uh, ankle was out of practice. No, he woke up today and his ankle was swollen. They gave me some technical term for, for it that I have no chance to even, even if I wanted to tell you, the chances of me remembering whatever they said, that, that the, it was, he well, it was, it wasn't his, the Long Beach State ankle, it was the other one. He woke up today and that's, that was that. His prognosis is good? Or? By the time the game came around, the swelling was down. Um, but again, you know, um, these games are important, but his career is more important and the rest of our season is more important. So, um, you know, hopefully with the day, you know, we don't need him again until maybe Wednesday. So we might as well just give it some time. That is one of the nice things of the Pac-12. You always, you know, although we got a, we might have a lot of three-game weeks coming, so we better get him healthy for that. And then you alluded to the five-guard lineup. It seemed yeah. like it gave you a nice lift when you had it out there. Yeah, at times, I mean, it's, you know, tough to get a rebound, you know, in a high major game against a team that big and strong. Um, guys look like flies next to Roman Silva out there. Uh, I was waiting for him to get a fly swatter. We were trying to jump around him, so. But they never quit. Um, I thought they gave a great effort. Um, they're athletic. They're not easy to play against. Um, they competed. They made enough shots early. Um, so it was, you know, really what we needed to have to play, take a team was making hard shots and find a way to get them out of it. And I thought our, our energy and our effort started disrupting their flow. That was the difference for us. And our execution, we haven't talked, you know, we, we got a lot, 40 points in the paint and 21 free throws. So you get 61 on layups and free throws, you're going to win. Hey, Coach, uh, could you touch a little more specifically on Jalen's um, 
contributions offensively, his efficiency shooting. Yeah, players. you know, it's funny because he, he's improved immensely offensively. I thought she made two threes. They only got him, they made us a foot on the line. But, um, you know, what happened with, with um, early in the season when he got the concussion, it threw his rhythm off. It's hard to not practice for two weeks and then come back. Um, you, when you get a concussion, you just do absolutely nothing for two weeks. And he had a real one, you know. Um, then he came back and he didn't know, he had a bad cold, he was dizzy, he didn't know if it was a concussion. So it messed him up for the whole, um, the rhythm that he had grown offensively that was showing in practice got all out of whack when that happened to him. So that's how he's been playing, you know, that's, that's what I was predicting in the preseason because that's what I was seeing every day. So it's good to see him uh, get out there and get in a rhythm. So Jaime better hurry back, he's in trouble. You've said before, I think it was after Villanova, that Jalen has a little bear cat written on him. Yeah. <laughs> what, what does that really mean? I guess like. Win games without making shots. Bob Huggins taught me that in 1996. And he's won 900 and something games with very few teams that could shoot it well. Real teams win when the ball doesn't go in. That's why I mean, so we made two threes tonight. We won handily and scored 81 points. So real teams win when you don't make shots. They win with toughness, togetherness, defense, hustle, you know, all the things. And that Jalen Clark's great at all that stuff. Although he's improved at making shots.